good, people. Um, what's 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 happening, y'all? I can't even get my introduction straight. I have never been pissed off in a 24-hour time period in my whole goddamn life. Okay, let's get it all out right now. Okay, all right. The CEO of World Entertainment, Open World Entertainment, I've discussed this in a couple of videos before, has been found guilty of rape and sexual assault charges. Cool, his ass needs to go. But the idols that participated in it got off on the goddamn technicality. Are you fucking kidding me? This is what the report said. They said that since the girls didn't speak up or they didn't fight, then it's whatever. Meaning that, you know, that was it, all they got. The fucking CEO made them participate in this. And they were willing to do this. But they didn't get charged. I think they need to get charged for doing that shit. Okay, this is some fucking like, you know, <sighs> this is some double standard shit. I don't, it's, it's ridiculous. Okay, he gonna sit here and be like, oh, they're idle. Did you get off like quietly? No, 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 no. Rape is rape and it's fucking wrong. And when you do that to somebody, you need to get punished and take your ass to jail. I don't care all your pretty good looks or your ego or your little, um, eyeliner, guy liner, whatever, the cool, smooth, swagger moves, or a little video, fuck that motherfucker, you need to go to jail, okay, that's not even cool, I think that's some fucked up shit, to let that even slide, okay, so all the motherfuckers at Open World Entertainment, you can kiss my ass, and I'm so glad that Jujin contract is ended, because he said I don't have nothing to do with this, because that motherfucker was an army, okay, it's just ridiculous all that shit went down, and the motherfuckers got off of the technicality. Bullshit. This just happens in the music industry all the time. But I hope some people would, you know, just step up and say something. <sniffs> Moving on. Fuck North Carolina. If you know what I'm talking about, we have to go and vote, you know, for the amendment, you know, not to ban gay marriage in North Carolina. Unfortunately, motherfuckers went and voted. And I'm like, really? Got the fucking highest divorce rate, but you can go ban fucking gay marriage. Are you fucking kidding me? Really? This is some bullshit, okay? I live in a fucking country where our freedom of speech and our freedom of expression is slowly getting taken away. It is. And now the people that we want to marry, man, woman, is the you know, the freedom to who we love is getting taken away. Cause these little Bible thumper motherfuckers out there, it, it pisses me off, man. That's not fair. It's not right. And if any motherfuckers out here don't like what I said on this video, you can kiss my ass. You need more than that to feel in your life. You need more than baby Jesus. You need a brick thrown right at your cranium. Smack that. Boom. That's what you need. That's what you need. And this motherfucking skinhead neo-Nazis had a fucking online thing saying, to protect our white brotherhood, please vote for vote against vote for the banning of gay marriage. What? Somebody need to be voting against y'all motherfuckers. Fucking skinheads crack me up. Y'all the you know what skinheads are? Fucking posers to me. For real. You motherfucker Kiss skinheads, Ku Klux Klan motherfuckers ain't got shit going on. Yeah, you little robe, white robes, what? Fuck y'all, for real. Your motherfuckers all in hiding because everybody wants to kill y'all. So sit down, shut up, and go to sleep. But anyway, for real, like I said, our freedom of speech, our freedom of expression, okay? The government's going to take away our what we have on the computer, like our music and all that stuff away, trying to take this away. And now look, if you see what they're trying to do, take away our freedom to love who we want to love and be with, you see that shit? Y'all need to stand up and y'all need to fight for it. Uh, before I continue, I had some knucklehead tell me that I shouldn't, like, make a rant about videos and shit, like the Jenny Hewn situation. I made a video about that. She says, why should I make a video ranting on about that? Um, I think you shouldn't do that. Fuck you, lady. The 
don't tell me what the fuck to do. This is my channel. I stand up for what I believe in. And I believe that you have to speak up so everybody can hear. And if they hear, it's imprinted in their mind. And when it's imprinted in their mind, they can go out and they can do something for the community. And they can speak out and help. I refuse to be a spineless jellyfish that sits on the back of a computer and won't do nothing or won't say nothing. As a black person, you dumb little girl, you should be glad I spoke out on behalf of all black people to defend us because this motherfucker was saying that the whole fucking black race should be extinguished. And the bitch that put the comment on it saying I shouldn't have said that, I'm like, you shouldn't have said nothing, and I, you should be fuck you. Okay? You should be glad someone said something at all and stood up. And that's what I'm doing right now. I'm standing up for all my gay friends. Okay? All of them. And I am tired of this shit, okay? I see all this stuff in the news where, like, all, like, these, you know, all these suicides and stuff and just, it just hurts. It's, it's, it gets to me. Sorry. It gets to me. And, like, no one wants to do anything about it because you're just too fucking scared. Stop being fucking scared and, like, stand up and have a voice, damn it. You know, people look at me and think I'm just loud and I, you know why I am? Because I want folks to listen, to listen to what I'm saying and to think. That's why I do all these crazy rants and shit on here because they're really actually something that you need to listen to. This is what you need to listen to. You motherfuckers in North Carolina, y'all make me sick. Not all of you, but some of you that voted, you know, to ban gay marriage, it make me sick. Okay? You sit here and you don't want nobody to, to be with somebody they love. That's not fair. You all hugged up at night with everybody and with your loved one and married and they can't be with her. That's a, you should be ashamed of yourself. I hope you'll be able to sleep at night. Wait a minute. I hope you won't be able to sleep at night. I hope your conscience just eats at you for the rest of your life. Sacks of shit, but in good news today, the chief sponsor, um, Jeff James Forrester, he was that chief sponsor of the anti gay marriage. <laughs> he died. Karma's a bad bitch, and it beat him right where I was at, too. You're probably thinking, Oh, Algie, that was so sad. The man just died. I know, but still, though, seriously, you voted for against this, and you dropped dead the next day. Boom, what is that telling you? Get your facts straight, people. Come on now. All right, time to fight for your rights. Our free speech is being taken away. We gotta get that back. Freedom of expression is taken away. We gotta take that back. The stuff on the computer that we have, take that back. This, we need to take it back. Man, woman, woman, man, woman, woman, man, man. It doesn't matter. People deserve to be who they want to be. I'm tired of hearing all this. It should not be no. It should be Adam and Eve, not Adam and Stevie. What the fuck? Shut up! Okay? Alright? In the Bible, there is no Hebrew word for homosexual in there at all. Yes, by that side me shit, but if you look in there, there's not none in there at all. People actually sit down and read the Bible once in a while, but shit's not in there. But I'm not gonna bring out this biblical shit up because I don't wanna hear it. I'm just upset right now. That this just fucking happened. And if you don't like me for saying this video, you can go and fuck yourself right now. And trust and believe me, if you leave a fucking crazy ass comment on this video, call me some black monkey or some shit, or saying I'm a faggot lover and shit, you best to believe I will curse you out so bad. Motherfuckers from another solar system will laugh at you. Try me if you want to, boo. I'm not the one. Now, the people out there that agree with me, leave me your responses and also your thoughts on this video. Because I'm one pissed off person right now. Y'all people need to get together and start fighting for the better of the good and just stop hiding behind these doors and speak up and voice out. Because if this happens, it's going to keep happening. You know. Georgia, I want gay marriage to be here in Georgia so bad, but there are so many backwashed redneck motherfuckers here. It is ridiculous. And you know, the, there's a high population of gay gay community in Atlanta, but I have a feeling that 
motherfuckers ain't gonna ain't gonna let it ride and I'm gonna be really mad and I'm gonna go go postal. Well I ain't go postal but I'm gonna be mad but you know. Leave your thoughts. I'll talk to you later. Peace. Peace it.